Welcome back, everybody, to Bravely Default 2. We will be... Today, we will be taking on... Bernard. Bernard's Manor. Not treat elements such as sleep and poisoning lightly, friend. Though they may be fleeting, a mere moment's distraction can be a life's end. And then, there are those elements that even last beyond the end of battle. To leave such afflictions untreated is to sometimes become unable to use items or the magical arts. One must first understand each element and in knowing it, know the which which must be laid in store in order to counter its effects. And of course, such knowledge can also be used to highly effective use in inflicting the very same ailments on one's enemies. Yes, right, anyway. Let's get started, we're gonna do Bernard's Mansion. I'm I'm going to be cutting out the uh, traveling portions. So oh, why are they moving? Yeah, we're gonna cut out the uh, traveling portions. Um, I'm gonna be experimenting with a new format here because of the fact that I have been getting copyright claimed. It's the reason why I haven't been doing much videos on this series. So I'm hoping that by muting the music, I can at least bypass that. You! I've been summoned to the palace. Look after things while I'm gone, will you? Sir! Seems the prince was as good as his what? They've left the place lovely and vulnerable, eh? But not completely unguarded. We'll have to keep our eyes peeled for more soldiers. Plus, we don't know when he'll be coming back. Let's get in there and get out with the crystal as quick as we can. Yes, we must hurry. Oh, party chat. Let's see what we got. Bernard's humble abode. Kyogi, this place must have set Bernard back up pretty penny. Yeah, and it's filled with beautiful stuff too. Some of those things will fetch a fortune at auction. I have to say, I was expecting the decor to be a whole lot tackier. Oh, who would have thought he'd be a man of wealth and taste, eh? Stylish, understated. Yep, this lot cost a packet and no mistake okay i'm going to say it. i'm impressed oh hey, me too top box to bernard for his taste and interior design i'm surprised you even care about this stuff <laughs> you don't grow up a posh boy without learning a wee bit about the finer things lassie oh yeah i keep forgetting you grew up with a silver spoon in your mouth guess you must know trash from treasure huh that I do, and there's precious little trash to be seen around here. Still, this stuff's probably all stolen, right? Or bought with dirty money anyway. I won't be surprised. Must let that man's exquisite taste distract us from the fact that he's a wrong guy, eh? Not that we can talk. I don't want sneaking around this house. Heh, <laughs> suppose it right. Let's hurry up and bag this crystal, shall we? I find it funny he tells them to protect the mansion. But these guys are all running away. The water crystal. It looks a little different from the wind crystal. Its power is being drained. If this continues... That will be quite far enough, thank you. Bernard? There's... No way you made it back from the palace that quickly. I must say, robbery really is an awfully unbecoming habit for a princess. Says the man who stole the crystal from my people in the first place. <laughs> but that is what I do, dear princess. I take what I want, and no one can stop me. Then, once I have taken something, it is mine. And it stays mine. Neither you nor anybody else can take it back. How dare you! You presume to claim ownership of the crystal? You who cannot begin to imagine its purpose? Even my patience has its limits, thief! Oh? Oh, she's about to awaken her power now. Great! Now we got two. 
this light. I am that which flows, that which purifies, that which immerses. I am water. The power whose favor your grandfather did enjoy. My grandfather? You mean, this is the crystal's blessing? The very same. You are the last of the line of Musa. You are the one. The only. Should you choose to seal away the Knight's Nexus, Step forth into the crystal's glow. Embrace your destiny. Your fate is... You would hear no more. I need not. I know full well the duty that awaits me. I shall not turn back. I shall not retreat. Forward. Only forward. You accept your destiny? Of course. Then I will say only one last thing. Though your grandfather accepted his destiny before you, the path he chose did not enable him to fulfill it. What does that mean? You must find that out for yourself. I will be watching, daughter of Musa. <sighs> that light. Gloria, did you? I did. The light of the water crystal is with us. Now, to battle. Endless, priceless water at no cost whatsoever. The crystal is quite literally a money machine. No entrepreneur in their right mind would give up a golden goose like that. There's only one way you're getting it. By prizing it from my cold, dead hands. <laughs> Let's don't let him get to you guys. My time to shine is... We're gonna turn on the uh, water... We're gonna turn on the uh, battles here a little bit. Oh yeah, I should also cast... Benediction right, for myself here. Perfect. Now to uh, see about Bernard. Yeah. Right. Let's see. Do some more physical damage here. Right, so let's get My it. time to shine, eh? Here I go. Shut up and dance. Perfect move. Prepare for impact. It's nothing. You are about to witness my true power. Yes. Be here. Oh, thanks for bailing me out. Thanks for bailing me out, my didn't really save my bacon. Yeah! <laughs> Just yes. Perfect. Spirits protect us! I need it! You rang? See um oh I never actually figured out that guy's uh, weakness so well. There's more than one way to skin a cat. Prepare to meet your maker. Yeah! 
Whoa, holy shit, that took a half of some HP. I'm almost impressed that you found this place, you know. But I don't for one second believe that you did it without help. It was Annie Hal, wasn't it? I knew it. I knew that filthy urchin couldn't be trusted. Not content with wrinkling noses left and right with that monstrous stench of hers, she goes and adds betrayal to the list. Well, that settles it. Once I'm done with you, she's next for the chop. Guess it's my turn. Shit, well, now we have to kill him. Otherwise, he's going to kill Annie Hall, and we cannot have that. Shit, though, <laughs> it's a good <laughs> HP. Jesus, okay. Try this for size. Produce right, so let's get yeah. I'm up, huh? I'm pretty much just making sure that he. Yeah! Ouch! Ah, uh, we have no weakness for that. That's a little unfortunate. My time to shine, eh? Take this! Ha -ha! I'll rob you of your life! Oh boy, that was a little close there. Yikes. What is this thing? You rang? Alright, it's time for us to start inflicting physical damage. Right, so let's get it. Okay, what's the plan? Yeah! Hmm, what's the plan? This should do it! You are about oh, to witness my true power! Alright, now let's... Let's launch an attack here. I shall take care of this. Follow my lead, everyone. Huh. There is much work yet to be done. Oh, what's next, I wonder? Alright, everybody. <laughs> Fucking dog pound. Oh, Alrighty! Ah! Primordial forces consume Mil you! Maelstrom of magic <laughs> assail you! Right down my enemies! Maelstrom of magic <laughs> assail Guess you! Guess it's my turn. Dear God, he's, <laughs> he's just like, what the fuck is happening? <laughs> Prepare for impact! Yeah! yeah. I'm all set! Let's see, uh, let's do a flying heel drop. Cross cut. And then a neo cross cut. And then a stone of activation. <laughs> this will shut you up. This really Dead. Jake's up, Bernard! Well, we almost kicked the bucket there. Glad that worked. Should've went for the Qui-Gon wave, but that's alright. It's over. Impossible. It can't end here. Stop it, Bernard. Just stop. Anyhow? Please, you have to stop being bad. Who asked your opinion, girl? And why should I listen to you after you stab me in the back? Honestly, I don't know why I bother. They all fail me in the end. I... I'm sorry, Bernard, but I... Ah! Oh, shut up and make yourself useful for once! Ugh! Oh my god, she doesn't need enough. <laughs> Prince Castor! Sorry, Fifi Pants. There's nowhere left to run. Now, if you would be so kind as to hand over the crystal. Aye. 
and we'll have your asterisk off you while we're at it. Well, that's sad then. You're surrendering. Good. It's not too late for you, Bernard. <laughs> What's so funny? I don't like where this is Surrender? going. Me? Are you out of your minds? When I say that's that, hmm. I mean for you and your friends. What do you mean? You've been led by the nose every step of the way. And by none other than your dear friend, Prince Castor. Your Highness, this can't be true, can it? How priceless. Did you think the handsome prince had arrived on his white horse to save the day? I do hate to disappoint you. Bravo, your highness. Or rather, your majesty. Oh, he's right in back of him. No! Ah, what? Holy shit, he fucking killed him! Curse you! No! Caster, what did you just do? I did as you saw. Rid the realm of a thief and a villain. But as we will learn, though departed, Lord Bernard can still be of use. Arrest them. They are to be tried for the murder of Lord Bernard. Throw them in the dungeons. Sire. You fucking, fucking what? You fucking what, mate? You had designs on the crystal all along, didn't you? I did. And Bernard, being Bernard, made it all too easy. I must thank you all for the part you have played. Oh, we've been played all right, like a blessed fiddle. I'm afraid you have. But try to think of it as fate taking its inevitable course. Get them out of my sight. There will be no need for that. We will come quietly. Prince Castor, some say that, far from being inevitable, it is our actions that steer the course of fate. You would do well to remember that. The water crystal really is an object of surpassing beauty. Its bold blue glow is so far removed from the arid barrenness of the desert. This surely is the power that will bring our land to life again. Yes, this is a prize worth any cost. Even the destruction of Musa. All that remains now is to silence those fools on the Council of Elders. It is I, the King, who will decide the fate of the realm from now on. I and no other! People of Savalon! I, your Lord and Master, grant you the blessing! Of water! <laughs> Damn, Caster's voice actor is putting in a lot of work here. I like it. I mean, yeah, I could, I could switch to that Japanese dub whenever I want, but... I'm not a full weeb. It's no good. There's no way out. We know that, so stop wasting your energy and sit still. Wonder how Annie Hal's doing. I guess the best we can hope for is that they threw her in a cell too. And here I was thinking traveling with the one and only Princess Gloria might keep me out of trouble for once. So much for royal privilege, eh, your highness? Princess Gloria? Of Musa? Prince Pollux? Is that you? But what are you doing locked up down here? Prince Castor said you were off exploring the world. If only that were true. Alas, my brother has deceived you. I have been a prisoner here for many days now. Gosh, 
What's happened to him? <sighs> he has not been the same since he came into possession of a certain strange stone known as an asterisk. Oh shit, he's an asterisk holder. He has one too, huh? Where did he get it? I am not sure. He mentioned having received it from a traveler of some description. A traveler? But never mind that. What was my brother thinking sending you, of all people, down here to rot, your highness? And how is everyone finding the dungeons? It's him. Prince Castor. Please, I have to know. Why did you steal the crystal? Why? Because I wanted it, of course. Is that not perfectly obvious? Our country is a barren desert, barely able to grow enough to support itself. So it was only natural that I coveted the crystal. I must protect my realm, my people. And to think that fool Bernard thought to keep it for himself. We were so lucky that you arrived here when you did, Princess Gloria. Just in time to sacrifice yourself for the sake of Savalon by allowing us to silence you once and for all. What? Damn it. We need to get out of here. I'll let you out. Anyhow. My friend here found the key. One second. Thank you, Anihal. My friends are in danger. You have to save the city. We will. But if we're going to do that, we'll need you to look after Prince Pollux for us. Can you do that, Anihal? Please, Princess Gloria, help my brother. He is not himself. We will, Your Highness. Oh shoot, party chat. I guess this will be the last one. Whatever it takes. Listen, Gloria, or Prince Caster. Thank you, but you need not worry on my behalf. Still, you've been friends since you were kids, right? Yeah. Yes, there weren't too many princes and princesses of our age, so it was inevitable, really. I just cannot imagine what could have happened to him. How could he have changed so much? He was always so dutiful. Always putting his kingdom first. You know, you know that we're probably going to have to fight them, right? Yes. And you're okay with that. I have resolved to do whatever is required in order to reclaim the crystals. No matter what or who stands in my way. Whatever awaits us, I will not turn from the path I have chosen. I am the last of the Muzin line. I have a duty to my kingdom, and I have a duty to my old friend. If he has chosen the wrong path, he must be stopped. I can see that your mind's made up, and I'm not about to stop you. Don't worry, Gloria, we're going to get those crystals back. I won't rest until we do. And that's the end, uh, everybody. Thank you for watching, and come back next time. Oh boy, we got some side quests here. No, I don't want to see no side quests. But yes, until the next episode, everybody, stay fresh. No, actually, wait. Let's get out of here and see uh, if there's any cutscenes that will show up. Ah, okay, so that's where it leads to. Well, until the next episode, everybody, stay fresh and uh, have yourselves a damn good day.